Hey, what's happening gamers? It's August 7, 2013. But before we get to your Nintendo news, I have some WB stuff to report. First, new skins were announced for Batman Arkham Origins on the PS3 and Xbox 360. The Batman First Appearance skin will be available for those of you that pre-order the collector set, but sadly, it's not coming to the Wii U. Also, four new skins were revealed as the Legend Skin Pack. While the Thrill Killer, Earth 2, Long Halloween, and Roundtable Batman are exclusive to JB, which is in the UK, it should be noted that all skins revealed for our Europe friends during Batman Arkham City all made their way to everyone months before the Game of the Year editions. And in Injustice news, Zatanna was announced and is wearing her traditional costume rather than her new 52 look. Also at this time, no word on when Martian Manhunter and Zatanna will appear on the Wii U. My guess is November. Now for your Nintendo news, officially now. As I'm sure some of you know, the Big N had another Nintendo Direct today, though nothing major was really announced except for a few things. Sonic Lost World will drop on October 22nd for both the U and 3DS. Other than more B-roll footage, not much new was announced from it. Next, Iwata talked more about Pikmin and being able to take photos in the game. In case you've forgotten, Pikmin released at the start of this week. The Direct continued with the Pokemon Rumble U game, which they teased in previous Directs. Although we did see the NFC feature in use. Also, you can use Pokemon toys that will be released very soon, but you don't need to buy the toys in order to experience the game. Pokemon's first entry on the U releases August 29th. Further details and new exclusives were revealed today for Rayman Legends on the U, such as being able to replay most of the levels from Rayman Origins, though these are just fan selects. Also, new Mario & Luigi exclusive skins and touch features just for the U-Pad. The game will arrive on September 3rd, hopefully. Keeping with the year of Luigi, Iwata confirmed that Mario's brother will indeed be in Super Smash Bros. U and 3DS. Also, on August 11th, Mario & Luigi Dream Team will hit store shelves for the Nintendo 3DS. And personally, I really love the Mario RPG series, and I've heard good things about the newest installment and can't wait to get my hands on it. Even though Animal Crossing released in June, Iwata and Isabel showcased the brand spanking new Animal Crossing Plaza as a free download for your U. Though the service will only be open until the end of 2014. Still, it's a cool place to hang out, get QR codes, and meet different animals from all over the world. As well as interact with the Miiverse community too, which is a major plus. Zelda fans also have a lot to look forward to in 2013, though the Direct felt like a Zelda for Dummies edition. In fact, Iwata told people about the Tribe Force and what it is, and how there's a light and dark world in A Link to the Past. Okay. Still, we did get some new gameplay to drool over. As for the Wind Waker HD, Iwata says they've actually tweaked the boat mechanics. Making the ability to sail faster and treasure hunting easier, supposedly. Though guess what, I'll believe it when I see it, Nintendo. Remember, you promised that Ocarina of Time 3D would be different too, and it really wasn't. Hey, you sellers of rare games, prepare to cry, because Nintendo plans on bringing lots of retro love thunder this year. Since they've already re-released Shantae and Earthbound, now they plan on doing an incredibly revered title from Japan. That's right, it's Summer Carnival 92 RECCA. The most legendary shoot 'em up of all time will be coming to an eShop near you. And as we close today, Nintendo was officially declared that not only the Professor Layton and the Azran Legacy would come in 2014, but also the epic crossover between Phoenix Wright 2. If you are a fan of the prof and the best attorney like ever, this is some epic news that is enough to explode the entire fabric of the world. Well, unless they announce a Mario and Sonic platformer. But still, this is pretty big. In fact, please enjoy the reveal trailer in English at the end of this video. And well, gamers, that's it, that's all. Thanks so much for watching another K News. Quick reminder, our Animal Crossing series is going on daily over on the Let's Play channel. So make sure you check that out for your chance to win a free copy of Animal Crossing. And with my plugs all said and done, have an awesome rest of your day, and until we meet again, gamers, God bless and happy gaming. See you later, wingdings.